Hey guys, and welcome back to Hawk Talk News. Today we're going to be covering a variety of interesting stories, starting with what's in my mouth. Ew. Is that a worm? Okay. Is it pasta? Yeah. It wasn't even in their mouth. I don't know, but I know I don't want it in my mouth. Okay, so now hot around to some fun facts. I'm Ainsley, and my crew and I are here today to give you a couple of fun facts. Oh, hey! Did you know that more people die from vending machine accidents than shark attacks? Did you know that Captain Crunch's full name is Horatio Magellan Crunch? Did you know that Coke has so many products that if you were to drink one per day, it would take you nine years? Did you know, without a wet floor sign, someone could slip. Did you know that a dime has a 118 ridges, while a quarter has 119 ridges? Did you know stair climbing burns more calories than jogging? Did you know if you don't do any of your work, you will fail? Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. Now back to the news desk. Here's another fun fact, Hawks. Prom is tomorrow, so I hope you have your outfits ready. So make sure you have your dress and tux ready and your wigs and weaves intact. Here's another fake fact. Bryson thinks he can dance, but now on to some people who can actually dance. Do you want to waiver into or out of a class next year, Hawks? Waiver forms are on the bottom of your yellow registration form and you'll be able to turn them in until March 30th, the day before spring break.
In light of recent events, you may have noticed some changes around Hillgrove. In order to enter the school during school hours, you'll have to call the number on the door posted because all the doors will be locked during the school day. We go to Bailey Cook to find out why some changes have been made. Hello, I'm Bailey Cook reporting for Hot Talk News. Today we're reporting on the tragic Parkland, Florida shooting where Nicholas Cruz brutally murdered 17 of his former classmates at Stoneman Douglas High School. Stoneman Douglas High School administration had previously been warned and had seen for themselves the brutality of Nicholas Cruz's actions when he stalked a girl, had, had multiple times pulled fire alarms, and had gotten into multiple fights. The Sheriff's Department had also been warned when multiple complaints had been filed against him, had they been called to his house because of fighting, and the FBI had also been warned when anonymous tippers called into a hotline and said that Nicholas Cruz was planning a school shooting. They also reported that Nicholas Cruz had introduced himself on a YouTube video saying he wanted to be a professional school shooter, and they did nothing. What can we do to prevent this? Hey Hawks, today, March 14th, students demonstrated in the courtyard for support of the Stoneman Douglas High School shootings. But remember Hawks, anytime, any day, you can be part of the solution. Don't let this be a fleeting moment. Always, always work towards a safer school, be nice to people, report anything that you see that could possibly be anything, anything at all. It's better to report something that isn't anything rather than not reporting something that is something. So Hawks, be good. Hey Hawks, this has been Cecia. And Ryson. Have a Demfi weekend at prom. Uh, stay lit guys. <laughs> I forgot my life. <laughs>